Hey everybody, welcome back to Lost Shadow. We're going back into The Walking Dead, Season 2, Episode 2. Um, I'm going to have to restart it. I, I've only played like 15 minutes of it. I was playing it, and I thought I was recording. Then I looked down, and the damn recording button wasn't working. So I'm going to restart it. I didn't make it too far, and we're going to go from there and see what happens. So let's jump right in and see. And let's catch up. To run this chapter, please choose the file. Okay. All the way over the back. Um, fuck. This one. That one. Are you sure you want to overwrite save file? Yes. I want to erase it. I want to start from the beginning. Because I looked down and it was not recording. And, oh my god. So everybody, welcome back. Here come, Here's to a new good game. Mm. A good episode. It started out really good. I liked it. Let's just get back to where we were and previously here we go. The Walking Dead. I'm freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about cold. I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I, I'm by myself. Bullshit. Krista, run! Mm -hmm. I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, uh -huh. Would someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on here? She was bit by a dog. For all we know, she could be working with Carver. So, since you're... Pretty much on your own. What's your plan? Plan is get the hell out of here. I'm thinking about moving oh. on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. No. Think about it. You're Carver. What do you do? Who's Carver? You were in the woods with Krista. Please. I'm fine. I'm fine. Just, just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Come this way. Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you. Look at that. Oh. We're coming. Oh, no. We have to go. You could have saved him. Yeah, How could you just leave him? I saved Pete last time. That's not right. <laughs> the hell? Alright, so it's, we changed around a little bit, now we saved Nick instead of Pete. I don't know why. I'm sorry, but it didn't record properly, and now it's I messed it up. Find something. What's the plan? Help me. Nick, find something. What are you doing, Nick? You close that door. Sorry, Nick, but I'll let you know he died either way. So, are you crazy? You think Luke will find us? I'm sorry about Pete. Whatever. Why'd you leave my uncle? Um, to save you. Back at the stream. Why'd you follow me? Pete got bit. What? He got bit. He wasn't going to make it. I saw it. It's on his foot. You probably don't believe me, but... Tough shit, dude. What do we do now? 
I don't care. If we're stuck here, we should at least look around. Maybe we can find something to help us get out of here. Knock yourself out. Dude, you really got a piss poor attitude. That is for making moonshine. It's a still. I know what it is. The fuck you do. Okay, what then? It's for making booze. But that rig ain't fit to piss in. What's in the box? All this food is rotten. I said this food is rotten. Oh, come on, boyo. Alrighty. Hey, that's what I'm looking what for. What is that stuff? Let me see. It's moonshine. He's like, oh yeah. yeah. <sighs> whiskey. What? Right, whiskey. Now what? Now we get drunk. Oh fuck if I know. We wait, I guess. It's whiskey. Alright, let's wait. Hey. That was simple. We're locked in a shed. Let's just sit here. Good. How do you sleep like that? Oh, he he he's done. Got pissed drunk. I'm gonna go, go punch him or something. What's your malfunction, boyo? What's your problem? Yeah, yeah. Calm the fuck down. I had to kill my mom. Good for you. We watched your uncle die. Huh. Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? Luke always used to push me. To be a better man. I never wanted to go into business with him. I remember when he sold me on it. His big plan. Some fucking plan. Oh, yeah. Case of beer in, he just said, Nick, we're burning daylight. And that was that. After six months, we were flat broke. Huh. I didn't care. We were having fun. I wish I was like him. I wish I could just keep moving all the time. Then do it. I'm just not. Grow up. Built like that. I don't care. Everyone I grew up with. It all happened to them. Now, it's gonna happen to us. No, it ain't. We're gonna get the hell out. We're all so fucked. This whole world is fucked. We'll make it. Bullshit. It's because you're pissed drunk. I mean, what's the point? We'll just march to some new place and somebody else will die. Yeah, probably. It's never going to stop. Oh, well. Eventually, it'll be our turn. Nah, I'm going to live. I can't believe we've been here a day. A day. It's been a day, right? Hey, kid. Nah. Don't do it, Clem. Have a drink with me. No, thanks. Listen. They're not coming for us. You should go. Run for it. What, what are you gonna do? Stay here. I'm tired. Go find Luke and the rest. They'll take care of you. I knew someone like you. He was always screwing up, too. Screwing up? I didn't ask for any of this. Neither did he. Nobody does. But so what? Mm -hmm. Come with me. Yeah. Are you kidding? And leave all this? Yeah. You can't just sit here and die. Why not? What does it matter? You still have Luke and everyone else. They're oh, family. Right. 
Nick, I need your help. Please. It's sober up, man. You're right. Quit drinking. Yeah. Now look, if we get separated, cabin's only half a mile from here. You can't miss it. You ready? I suppose. Fuck it. Hey, you zombies! Fuck you, motherfucker! Oh, oh Nick. Shit. What did you do? Hey, over here! Come on, you fucks! Look at me! Get the says. fuck out of here! Nope. Go to Nick. Run for it. Oh, shit! It's your fault, Nick. I didn't push the button in time. It's Nick's fault. It is. It's not mine. It's his problem. He let me die. Disappointed. Come on, get up. You're right. I know. We're, we've already been through this. I traveled back in time to tell you. So come on. Now look, if we get separated, the cabin's only half a mile from here. You can't miss it. Aye, aye. Yeah. Uh, you ready? That's gonna tear you up. Fuck it. That's what I'm saying. Fuck it, let's go. Can we skip this part? Ah! Fuck you, motherfucker. Oh no, yeah. Oh shit. You're an idiot. Hey, over here! Come on, you fucks! Look at me! Get the fuck out of here! Alright, I'll bring help. Don't worry, I'm out. Peace. Oh my god. Oh my god. Please tell me. We're already running. Don't be sitting down drinking moonshine or whiskey. Yeah. I pushed it. I pushed it. You. My goodness. This chair makes. All right. We're going to beat this woman. We're going to get the hell out of here. All right. Let's go. Here it comes. Focus. Yeah. Get it. Um, uh, uh. See? Uh, uh, bo -bo. All right, so now we should be back to the cabin. Fuck, in the beginning. Um, we're in trouble. Clementine, are you all right? Luke's not with you? No. Where's Alvin? I don't know. I don't know. What I happened? wasn't with Luke or it's Alvin. It's been hours. Where are they? Clem. We got attacked. By who? Walkers. Jesus. Pete got killed. I was with Nick, but... He told me to run. Thank God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Yeah. Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there. Get the guns. Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. It's not our problem. Damn it, Luke. Clementine, can you 
Can you please watch Sarah? No. She's upstairs. Just distract her. Just, Just go. Hurry. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. Yep. Gotcha. Say cheese. Dear God. I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. You shouldn't have been under the house. It's so cool. Take one of me. Come on, take one of me. You shouldn't scare people like that. Please? I'm not in the mood. Sorry, I just wanted to cheer you up. Isn't this the best? No. People. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? Fishing. I, this is the question I've seen. They're just fishing. I know that's not true. They're fishing. They're looking for somebody, but fishing. True, not true. I don't care. Sorry, I, I, I just need to. All right. So oh, now, yeah, we're gonna sit with her. We're gonna watch her. Be very careful. You want to see what I found? Um. Will you show me how to use it? No. I couldn't find any bullets. If something's wrong, I should know. It's too dangerous. Everything is dangerous. I need to know sometime. I agree. You should let your dad teach you. What should I shoot? Don't do that. S -s -s Sorry. Sorry. Yeah, you crazy. Maybe I could practice outside. No. There's that tree. No, you're not allowed to go outside. Hey, Luke's back. Uh, uh, then why didn't it show Luke? If Luke is here, why didn't it show him? Because Luke's not here. Come on. Put a little pep in your step. You're this. I'm gonna get your name, don't worry. Oh. This chair is it's very warm today. You I mean let's see. Yeah, I know. Gotta look at the window. But let's let's take a quick look here. Where's the damn weather? It is eleven forty six at night and it's seventy two degrees. It's warm. For it's it's really warm for midnight. It should be nice and cool. But no, in Vegas it's starting to get warmer. Soon the 120 degree weather is going to be here. Not going to be a good day. That's not Luke. No shit. Clem, I think I know him. He can't see me. Okay, go. You have to make him go away. Go and find somewhere to hide. Yeah. Where? No. Clem, I can't breathe. I can't, I can't breathe. Shut the Shh. Find you. Hello? Nope. Hello there. Uh, Get out of here. Now. Is that how your dad taught you to greet a neighbor? You're damn right. I've got a gun. A smart girl. I would too. But I'm not a bad guy, honey. Promise you that. I do. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? <laughs> Carly? Costa. Hello, I'm sorry to disturb you. I only need a couple minutes of your time. I'm going to kill you. This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. I'm alone. Really? Yeah. I take care of myself. Well, I'm impressed. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. 
Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. Bit taller than you. Hmm. Big black guy. This big. And a pretty little pregnant lady. I haven't seen him. Well, that's nope. a shame. You sure? Pretty sure. Who are you? Give me your name, fool. Grab that knife. Cut him. There's a knife in here. It's the only part that I remember. A lot of plates for one person. Looks like a tornado ran through here. I don't ever do the dishes. Hey, yeah, well, believe me, I don't either. Just passing through, or you been here a while? I'm... Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. Where does this go? Over there. Uh, in the drawer there. I was gonna catch you, but it didn't work. Well, it's a real nice place, kind of cozy. I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug son of a bitch, but a smart man. What happened to him? Let's just say we had our differences. Sooner or later, people close to you will find a reason to cross you. Yeah, it happens every time. Yeah, probably. It probably does. Well, well. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? Nah. Um... Old house creaking. I thought you said nobody's here. Nobody is. Um, nobody. I didn't hear anything. It's probably just the wind. Dude. Oh my god, I'm all itchy. Bum 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 bum. bum. She looks funny as hell down there. I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? You're poking around. Sure. Who's this? Hmm... Well, it's a kid. Yeah. Yeah. Looks like it was taken in this room. Oh, okay. I told you I was just passing through. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Nope. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? No idea. Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I think you I have. I let myself out. Thank God. Well, wait, who are you? You have a real good day now. Yeah, see. Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back? Oh. He's coming back. Just because he saw a picture of you. We need to find the others. We can't go outside. I'm not going outside. Clementine. Sarah. You were with Nick, right? We gotta go find him. Okay. Was here. What? What did she say? 
Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down? I am calm. I opened you the calm damn down. door. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? No. Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. Did he say his name? I didn't ask his name. You didn't ask his name? How could you not ask his name? He had a gun. I didn't want to make him mad. Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. I don't know. What was he wearing? I don't know. Did he sound different? Um. He had a big brown coat. Did it have a lining? A collar? Yeah, fur. Mm -hmm. He talked about you, Dad. You're not going to hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. <laughs> All right, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not going to do anything crazy or not nice, right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. Mm -hmm. All right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? Oh, yeah. He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. You told me to distract her. Distract? Sarah. So I'm just an idiot? I thought we were friends. Huh. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. If she hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. Mm. He's right. Mm -hmm. Everyone pack up. We're moving out. Yes, sir. Alvin, wait! Let's get the hell out of here. We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. Where are we going? Anywhere but here. Into the mountains, maybe. Yeah. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. No. We have to leave. I told him I didn't know you guys. Look, we gotta find Nick on our way out of here. You know where he was, right? Yeah. Maybe. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. Now, you said it was just up here? Mm-hmm. Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm just a little on edge. It's just a tough time right now with the pregnancy and all. You need to stop bossing me around. This hasn't been easy on me, but I'm trying, Clem. <laughs> I know you did your best back there. You know, none of us would make it on our own. Sometimes it's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. I'm not used to that. I'm not comfortable with that. Yeah, because you just come I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. You need to work on your, a Alvin lot. And I still don't know what to call her. Or him if that man gets his wish. God help me. Any ideas? Clem? There. That's where we were. Ooh, one. Two. You ready? Nick. Get the door. I got it. Don't worry. I don't see him. There he is. Question is, is he dead? Uh, he don't look dead. Jesus. Hey, man. You got any aspirin? Oh, he's pissed drunk. Nick, you asshole. Dead. I know, man, I do. We gotta get moving. 
Okay, Carver's gang showed up. Can you make it? Yeah. Yeah. Good, let's go. Uh, you better thank me for coming after you and coming back to get your ass. Hey, Clem. Uh, I just wanted to say thanks for not giving up on me. I'm sorry about Pete. Don't worry about it. Next time you should listen to me. I'm sorry about Pete. Yeah. Thanks. When she gets you. I'm sorry about Pete. What happened back there in that cellar? Um, can you do something stupid? He, like he can tell me. He got drunk. I'm just looking out for him. Nick saved my life. Really? Yeah, sort of. I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? I can suppose you, I can. You still want to come with us? Um. Look, I know we got off to a rough start, and I can't make any promises it won't get rougher. True. I have to look for Krista. She was headed north, right? Yeah. Yeah. So are we. Look, you're going to have but a better chance of finding her with us than on your own. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's going to be okay, Beck. It's, we have to keep moving now. It's going to take a it's little bit. Choice. Yeah, it's going to take a while to get there. Especially mm. Nick, how he moving like a fucking snail. But he's just sad and depressed and working off a hangover. Five days later. We're going to pause it. Alright guys, so we're going to end the video there. If you seem to like what's going on, please subscribe, hit that like button, leave me a comment, and we'll see you in the next video. You guys take it easy and have a good night.